Hello everyone, this is Moses from Zotzbad Gardens. I'm going to show you an experiment I did to try to capture gnats and fruit flies that were pretty much infesting my tomato plants. I'm going to show you the results of that right now. Come on Lulu, let's go. So as you can see right here, my row of tomato plants, and here is the issue, is the cher cherry tomatoes. The fruit flies just infested this plant like crazy. Um, and I know why. There was probably some cherry tomatoes that fell on the floor where I couldn't see them and just got infested that way. So what I did in this test is instead of just trying apple cider vinegar of what I've always heard, I wanted to try other type of things while I'm doing this experiment. So I've tried four solutions out and one of them is apple cider vinegar. You can see it towards the back. Red wine, white wine, white vinegar. Now I'm going to show you one by one the results of each. Pretty much nothing at all in the white vinegar. I'm surprised with that actually. As well as the white wine. Nothing in the white wine. No fruit flies, no flies, nothing. Now the red wine, you can see right here there was a snail with a drinking problem. But no fruit flies either. Or gnats or anything other than the snail. But the Apple cider vinegar is full of fruit flies. If I have to count them all, it's about 20 to 30 of them in this liquid. And oh, it's really strong from the sun beating down on it all day. But um, they've been here for about 24 hours and it's a pretty good collection. Now when I go through the plant and, you know, tap on it or hit it, there's no fruit flies coming out. So all of them did end up in the apple cider vinegar. Happy gardening everyone. Okay, like, share, subscribe. And thanks for watching everyone.